Howdy folks, hope you're all having a good weekend, and welcome back to Stray, where it looks like Clementine's managed to go and get herself arrested, which is bloody selfish if you ask me. We went to the trouble of getting the atomic battery from the factory for her. I can't even remember what she wanted the battery for. Start the subway up or something? Oh, I can just walk right in. <laughs> well, alright, I thought I was going to have to work my way around the back and do some climbing or something. Um, but no, I can just walk right through the police line, so... <laughs> fine. It's not going to be that simple, surely. Oh, more of those robots. Right. Yes, it's not going to be that simple. Okay, let's think about this. So it sweeps from left to right. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, and wait. And go, 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 go. Yeah, that's right. Too slow, little robots. Too slow for this cat. Alright, that one, I'm not getting past there. Can I jump over? Onto the sign, maybe? And then jump across? Yes, I can. Not sure I want to, though. Or need to. Oh, box. No, no, box. Get in the box. Get in the box. Actually, no, I don't need to get in the box. I can just... Yep, made it. Okay, let's get into this box. Oh, just in time. <laughs> Bugger off, little robot. Robots. Yeah, you and your friends. Nothing to see here. Definitely no cat. Uh, oh, bugger. It's blocked. Right. Can I get around here? Ooh. That was close. Or is that... Is that... Oh yeah, that's where I was. All right, so this is a dead end. I'll tell you what, Clementine, this battery better be worth it. Oh, up here. Right, cool, got it. Here we go. Oh, 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 shit. Bugger, 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 bugger. Where was the box? No box? Will this do? Yes. Yes, we're good. Oh, wait, maybe not just yet. <laughs> I think I will get in the box after all. Not quite sure what this fascination is with box. It's not just boxes, by the way. If you if you put some tape down on the floor in the shape of a square, a cat will sit in it. <laughs> right, I think I can sneak across here. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh! Hold on. Turn around and go the other way. Go on. There we go. Oh, and that's it. We're here. Clementine's apartment. Okay. It doesn't look like they've tossed the place. But she's not here. Oh, hang on. What's this? Has she left a message? Uh huh. The answer lies in my stuff. And then there's four symbols. So we've got four things. One of them looks like a lava lamp. A traffic cone, some crystals, and some kind of hippie scent diffuser. Okay. Well, there's a lava lamp there. What's this? Well, I wasn't that sure, actually. <laughs> lava lamp? No. If it is a lava lamp, it's not that one. What else have we got? Ah, some kind of hippie scent diffuser. There we go. Yes, I know, that was the atomic battery. That's not really what I was trying to do, though. I'm trying to compare this. It doesn't look like the first item, doesn't it? Yeah. 
Some smelly, scented thing. Some crystals. What looks like a traffic cone. There it is. I'm with blah, 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 blah. All right, I get it. So there's four parts of the message hidden around various different things in her flat. All right, fair enough. So that's one. Now we're looking for some hippie crystals. What looks like a traffic cone and what looks a bit like a lava lamp. So what do we got in here? What's that? Nothing obvious. Doesn't look like any of the things on the note. Oh, a traffic cone. No, is it? I don't know. It, it, it does. It's got to be it. But there's also a message. Yeah, there we are. I'm with something come to something. All right, two down, two to go. Anything in the kitchen? Not seeing anything obvious. Maybe up here in the sink? Nope, it's a watering can. Definitely not a lava, oops, wrong button. <laughs> Definitely not a lava lamp or a bunch of hippie crystals. Um, all right, let's keep looking. Was there anything? Oh no, that's where the um, traffic cone was. Now, how did I get up here last time? Oh, that was it. Open drawer. Oh, bollocks. No, back up. There it is. Right, hit me crystals or lava lamp. Those do look kind of hippie crystally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Message. There we go. I'm with Blazer. Come to something. So. Yes, yeah, yeah. I didn't actually mean it. Thank you, B12, but I didn't actually mean to click on the atomic battery. I was trying to look at the mysterious message. It does look like a lava lamp, doesn't it? But there was a lava lamp in the other room that wasn't... What about this? No, it's a traffic cone as well. Now, there's a couple of red herrings scattered around here, isn't there? Because there's, not, there's more than one traffic cone in this place, for example. Only one of them is the thing that we need. Oh, hang on, wasn't there another lava lamp? I'm sure I saw... Was it in here? Nope. Is it in here? Ah, oh, there's one up there. Let's just quickly check out here in the hallway. No, broken bike, that's not it. Right, how do we get up to that lava lamp? That has to be it. I mean, I did see another lava lamp earlier, but sometimes, you know, they show you more than one of the same thing and only one of them is the one that you want. This has got to be it. Yeah, I can inspect it. This must be it. It's a lava lamp, B12. Get to the message. There it is. So, I'm with Blazer, come to the nightclub. So, Blazer was the robot who smuggled me into the factory. Clementine's contact. Funnily enough, he was wearing a jacket. Because <laughs> a Blazer is a sports jacket, you get the idea. Oh, I've got to get out of here now, haven't I? Well, it should be substantially easier, because I'm a cat. I'll just jump down, surely. Yep. Yep. And... And run for it. Too slow, police robots. Too slow for this cat. Right, where's the nightclub? Down here on the left, I think. Go. Keep people outside. That, yeah, I'm pretty sure that is the nightclub. Yeah, bouncer. This is it. Oh, he still won't let me in. Have you not seen the Smirnoff adverts with a dancing nightclub cat? Come on. Oh, let me in. You're not going to let me in, is he? 
Big robot bastard. All right. Um, Got to be a way up, surely. Ah, uh, huh. Right, how am I getting up there? There's got to be a way. Hey, Albert, can you help out here? Uh, apparently not. Okay, never mind. There has to be a way up there, otherwise there wouldn't be somebody in the window staring down and drawing my attention to the obvious way in. So how do I get in? Uh-huh. Ah, here we go. Also, the other guy sitting on the roof here, swinging his legs is a bit of a this way sign. Hi! I'm a cat. Yeah, I'm, I'm up for partying. Cheers, Alex. Robot Knight, what the hell does that guy on the dance floor have on his head? No, no. Gotta stop getting distracted by shiny things. Hey, Alex. Um, yeah, I suppose so. Do you mind if I just, you know, <laughs> do cat things? <laughs> right, okay, so we're in the nightclub, fantastic. Now what? Take the strange drink, all right, fine. Well, it did say come in and get a drink, and now I have a drink. I am. You want this drink? Well, no, it's not for me, is it? No, okay, it's not for Alex either. Okay, let us investigate. Then again, we are in a nightclub, and I am on the dance floor. Well, it's boogie. Oh yeah, that's right, check out my moves. I am a dancing cat. Kind of. Sort of. Ish. <laughs> Close enough. <laughs> right. What's going on up here? I... It looks like I can interact with the turntable, but not yet, so I must need something. Wait a minute. Requested by Blazer. Blazer's here. Do you want this, uh... talk to the other DJ and they don't appear to care that I'm walking all over their turntable. All right. Use lever base. Oh right okay it's missing the lever so I need to find the lever. All right fine. Here. No. Oh, ah, here we go. I get it. Right, so now I should be able to interact with the turntable. Hello, Mr. DJ. I found a record. I think you should play it. Yeah, that's right. Check out them funky beats. I don't know what it's done. But seem to have enticed a few more people onto the dance floor, maybe? Or are they just changing places? Yeah, enough of that. <laughs> ah, there's a lever over here. What's happening? Can I get up? I can get up there. Where's this going to take me? Right. Okay. Don't seem to actually be able to go in. I'm gonna have to find the lever for the other one, aren't I? Do this from the other side. It's like this is just showing me what you can do. But I'm gonna need to find the lever. Alright. 
Anyway, what do you have on your face? I have to admit, it is it is very, very good. I want one. It's not helping me find a lever though, is it? So. Expecting to find one down here, but hey, you never know. I'll take a look around. It's been a while since I did cat things, isn't it? So I noticed you had a bunch of things on your table. Don't worry, I fixed that for you. <laughs> um, right, yeah, so where's this lever? Now he's out cold, holding it right within. Hello, I'm a cat. A VIP room. Ah. Yeah, tell you what, I'll swap you. You have this drink, and I'll have your lever. Right, so to the other thing, the one that didn't have a lever on it. Insert lever into lever base. Jump onto lever. Jump onto whatever the hell that is. Cheers, Mr. DJ. Right, okay, there's actually stuff back here. It's like some kind of control room. Switches my favourite kind. So what do these do? Moves the light rigs around. Oh, I get it. So I'm going to have to arrange this so that I can jump across. I think. Okay. Let's just stop pressing buttons at random, I suppose. Yeah, I can jump onto that, but I can't jump across to that one. No. Okay. Um, carry on pressing buttons, I guess. What does this one do? Ah, now that looks more like it. Yep, this is it. Oh, something happened. Wait, is that blazer and the leather jacket? What's he doing here? I suppose we're going to have to find out. Hi, I'm a cat. Well, you're clearly an arsehole. Anyway, what's blazer doing up here? A quick look around first. Nothing obvious to mess up or steal. Oh, something's happened. It's Clementine! Wait, why is she tied up here? I thought she was arrested. Uh-oh. Oh no, I've got a bad feeling about this. Blazer, you bastard! I never trusted him anyway. Oh, but, I mean, I don't care about Clementine, but how could you betray the cute kitty? No! Oh dear. Well, it looks like we're busted. And on that bombshell, well, that is it for today's episode of Stray. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you're all having a great weekend. And as always, take care, stay safe, and I'll catch you next time.